Well, I thought it was a fabulous idea for somebody to initiate uh, this project with the European Chamber of Commerce. I was very excited and I want to be part of it. I really thought at first that it was just a typical green program. I never really thought how deep it would go. I never really thought that it would uh, be this effective. When my daughter first heard of the smart school, Angie shared the idea with me of having our company improve our manufacturing as well as entering the green market. I am always open for ways that can make our company better, so the idea was well accepted. I was really interested in what they were telling us about SMART, which is to implement sustainability and uh, through green methods in our production and using sustainable materials for, for our design and our products. Smart Cebu is a project that we created in 2010 with the support of the European Union and the German Federal Ministry of Economic Cooperation. This project is supported by seven organizations headed by SEQUA, the European Chamber of Commerce, ADFIAP, EFA in Germany, Cebu Furniture Industries Foundation, the Cebu GTH, and the Cebu Fame. We launched this project with the idea of enhancing the competitiveness of companies and industries as a whole by uh, helping them go green. Going green is about looking at sustainable materials, natural materials that we can use to develop new products, as well as looking at eco-friendly processes that will go with the design of products that we can then uh, bring to the market all over the world. We are looking at uh, resource efficiency and cleaner production as a way of cutting costs in companies, in the cost of operations, and also looking at uh, ways to avoid waste so that we can contribute to a cleaner environment in Cebu. We started this with our Plant One facility in Barrio Tabuk, and we ask everybody else in the other factories to take part of this because they saw fantastic results in this factory and we um, engaged everybody to take part. The program was well received by our team. We shared with them the objective of joining this project. You know, this requires a little attention and time and follow-up. Initially, not really. Just like anything, if you implement some change, they will resist. Once they felt the effects, um, they started cooperating with me. So later on, um, the, the uh, program, when we talk about the processes, uh, it became almost like second nature. Although there are, we had a hard time implementing it, the, the programs, especially on, on, on the side of the production floor, um, what happened kasi, palang nakasanayan na nila. In other words, Instead of something new, it became something that they're used to already. What I have observed, our electricity bill dropped over the last um, few months since we implemented the, uh, the program. Sample is the installation of the spray pool, which makes the big difference. It makes our production process cleaner. Then we have the bleaching area, which shorten the process as well. Definitely, because it has not only benefited our factory, in terms of, of savings in, in uh, electrical consumption, but it also developed a new wave of using natural material more aggressively. Because from this project, uh, production-wise, uh, they taught us how to lessen our cost of electricity. They also taught us uh, simple suggestions of the flow of production where transfer of materials or items were easily done and most of all uh, the designs and the materials that we used. We were specifically attracted to the thought of using sustainable materials so we had to think of an old material for a new product so that is why we decided on Rafia. As the output of the ECC program what happened was we had a new category was uh, on the wall art as you can see on the walls of our showroom. So it was a good thing, a very good thing for us. Uh, uh, very unexpected with the design aspect. 
My company now is not just about design, not just about production, but it has something to do with um, producing them efficiently and then being more concerned about the environment as well. So when we sell our product, we tell our buyers that this is how we produce them. So in a way, it makes them uh, feel comfortable that um, our practices are uh, good in a way. We think and we care about the environment. One of the positive things I've learned about Smart Cebu is that they're not very close into certain categories or into certain industries only. They're very broad, which means that they're applicable to anyone who would like to use them. encourage all MSMEs to start your green initiatives now. It's not all about saving the environment, but it's really all about improving health and the quality of life. Above all, I'm proud to say that it's not only an effort for management, but the owners as well as the board of directors of Plantation Bay are the ones who are encouraging us to have green practices all throughout the hotel. If there's one thing we know here at Bee Resorts, being green, good business sense. It allows us to be a good community partner. It allows us to be a profitable business. Because in the end, it's not just about cents and pennies. It's about giving back to Mother Earth. So I invite the small, medium, and even big to become a green business in order to give back to the planet that we have. So come on now and be green. The good news about being eco-friendly is just not ending up protecting the planet, but also protecting your people. It is about generating more profits by going green. For this reason, we say green business is good business.